What's up, guys? My name is Miles. And my name is Fez. And this is The Commodity. And today we are reacting to the best places to live in the Philippines, top 10 cities and provinces. And if the top 10 is not your city and you want it to be your city, let us know in the comments Where and we'll, city we'll check your city out as well. Yes. Uh, yeah. So if you're ready to hop in, I'm ready to hop in. I am. Let's start with this picture. Yeah, magic. We're, we're doing the transition real quick. <laughs> so the first thing I notice is it looks awesome. Yeah. And it's got the boats right here. At first, I thought those were like houses. I did too at now first. Now that I'm looking at it, it's those boats with the, the buoy kind of things on the side. So obviously, this isn't fully a sandbar. Um, so are there homes that are... Because these can't be houses. These look like... Like somewhere where you just kind of stay out of the sun. Yeah. Uh, I like how the sand goes out. Like, like a you can tail. kind of get out of there. Yeah. Like we would be 100% the people that are sitting out over here. Oh, yeah. Because you just look to your left and right and you've got like the size of this room and then ocean. Yeah. 100%. So. But let's go ahead and hop in and check this out. Let's check. Philippines has already become one of the best places to retire in the world. Seems as Besides though. the great weather and low cost of living, many foreigners love the Philippines for its optimistic, warm and friendly Filipinos. But with so many amazing cities and provinces in the Philippines, it would be very difficult to choose where to live in the country. That's why we prepared a list to help That's you decide gorgeous. which city is the best for you. Please remember to subscribe and hit that notification bell. Mm, I love food. I'm so hungry. PH.net, follow. Here are some of the best places to live in the Philippines. Number 10, Makati City. Makati City. Although foreign nationals aren't permitted from owning land in the Philippines, they can still buy condominiums. Mm. The city of Makati is on top oh, of the list of places yeah. to you own You can't buy land, but you can this own an individual place. This is the undisputed place. business capital and the wealthiest city in the country, which is why many expatriates live and work like here. Like a home. Despite the heavy traffic, foreign nationals are drawn to Makati, since several career opportunities are available in the city. Plus, the place is also home to some of the best high-end shopping malls, fine hmm. dining restaurants, and luxurious five-star oh, hotels. Wow. Makati is also located in Metro Manila, the capital region of the Philippines, which is another main McDonald's. reason to choose the city. Those are probably most people's favorite pools, but the infinity pools are just so dope. I will say that's not going to drive me to go anywhere is high end uh, shopping shopping. Then like, you're going to spend more money. We're ch like this shirt right here. In fact, he bought it and he gave it to me and it's from Walmart and it cost three dollars it was on sale for three dollars so it's a really nice me. shirt though for three dollars trust me we live the stradman lifestyle yeah no this shirt this is a polo v-neck t-shirt but it was a christmas gift i got a pack of them <laughs> yeah no like my my shorts cost more than this shirt and yeah. they were not expensive either number nine tagging city Tagging City. Another great place to live in the Philippines, which is also located in Metro Manila, is Taguig City. The That's city beautiful. is known for BGC or the Bonifacio Global City, which is one of the leading financial centers in the Philippines. BGC is also an expert favorite the given w. the availability mm -hmm. of hotels, shopping malls, think, markets, restaurants, <laughs> hospitals, and everything else. What's awesome about BGC is that it offers a Ford. more modern and posh lifestyle. BGC is bar. also very clean, Empire safe, bar. and it has more open spaces and more trees. I'm guessing if we go to a place like this, we'll be broke. Number yeah. eight. I like how Hilo, it keeps Hilo. taking you back to the same place. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> like this is in every city. City. If you want a more quiet and peaceful place to live Me. away from the big city, then you might as well consider moving in Iloilo. This Ilo, province Ilo. located in the western Visayas region Jolly is Bee. known for several nicknames, including the City of Love, Museum City Ilo. of the Philippines, and the Heart of the Philippines. Iloilo City is considered as one of the most livable and safest cities in the Philippines. Besides the city's amazing safety. local dishes, I love countless livability. beaches and wonderful locals called Alangos, the place is also one of the cheapest places to live in the country. The city also has less traffic, and at times, there are even no traffic at all. Be there soon. Mm, that wouldn't make it in America. Number seven, what? Bacolod Space City. Paint? Oh yeah, no. Bacolod City is a first-class, highly urbanized Canceled. city and is the capital of the province of Negros Occidental, also located in the Western Visayas region. The city of Bacolod is popularly known as the City of Smiles. The water is just so gorgeous in these areas. Festival in 1980. 
the Colot is now starting to be a favorite place for foreigners. In fact, this was awarded twice as the top Philippine model city by the Manila Times and was hailed once as the best place to live in the Philippines. It is easy. So how do y'all, do y'all like foreigners coming to the Philippines or because like Hawaii, they're very anti-foreign or anti-travelers. Well, to be fair, they're all about sending Filipino people Everywhere. abroad. Yeah. So I feel like they welcome it. Yeah. Let us know. I mean, we're, we don't want to answer it for you, yeah. but I mean, we make our guesses and assumptions usually wrong, but we do like to, to guess at it. Yeah, he's wrong a lot. To say that Bacolod City is one of the best <laughs> place to live in, since the city is home to locals who are always warm. Oh, that's wow. cool. It has a that is dope. Rate, manageable traffic conditions, and with relatively low cost of living compared to that of Manila or Cebu. Number six, Cebu City. Cebu City. This first-class, highly urbanized city in the island of Cebu is the fifth most populated city in the nation and the most populous in Visayas. Just like the big cities That's in cool. Metro Manila, Cebu City, which is named as the Queen City of the South, also has its downsides. Traffic is still a problem in the city, and getting a ride in a public transportation during rush hours. They're driving on the right side of the road. That is because people from do they do that in the Philippines? The city to find yeah, they were. Uh... Oh the yeah, yeah. Territory of the United States. I just realized that. It's cool. <laughs> if they were a British territory, it'd be the opposite way. Right. So they're smart. They drive on the right side of the road. Thank you. And also because Cebu City is a popular tourist destination. Nope. The city yes. is considered as one of the perfect places to retire on a budget and still enjoy life's luxuries since it has everything you need in terms of tourism. Cebu City is famous for its world-class beaches. That's it has gorgeous. numerous shopping malls She's and gorgeous. also has wonderful and friendly locals. That's gorgeous. Everything's gorgeous. What's her name? What's her number? Davao City. Davao City. Though it is the third most populous city in the Philippines, Davao City is still not as crowded as Metro building. Manila and Cebu City, since it is the largest city in the Philippines. Davao is one of the most progressive cities in the Philippines. It's no surprise that locals and foreigners Jeepney. love living in the city, mm -hmm. especially because the place is very clean, it has low cost of living, and its crime rate is one of the lowest in the country, since rules and regulations were strictly cool. enforced. Yeah. Davao is also a popular tourist so destination for its stunning attractions, such as Samal How Island. How much would a home like that on the golf course cost? Like, here, I would think if it's a decent golf course, minimum around 800 to a million. In our area, yeah, yeah, like if it like minimum, in the highest especially the that Philippines, size, Mount yeah. Apo, which are Mount extra Apo. reasons to live in the city. Number four, Palawan. Palawan, the province of Palawan, nicknamed as Philippines' best island and Philippines' last frontier, is the largest province in the country in terms of total area and it ranks among the best islands in the world for travelers. That's beautiful. There are so many reasons why Palawan is considered to be a perfect place for locals, tourists, and foreign retirees. Besides its clean and green surroundings, the place is also home to <laughs> some of the green. most gorgeous beaches in the world, and the underground used that river before. of Puerto Princesa, mm -hmm. which was named as one of the world's new seven wonders of nature in 2012. Everything is also cheaper in Palawan, mm. and wherever you go on He's the island, the same there will always be exceptionally friendly locals who are very much willing to help. Number 3. Pampanga. Pampanga. Pampanga is a province located in the central Luzon region of the Philippines. The that place is so has cool. I want a hot air balloon. But what's great is it's still surrounded by many trees and mountains. Besides being near Manila and other great vacation spots, it also has they less have traffic a lot of than Metro Manila. Yeah. And the locals, Pampangueños, are some of the most hospitable people you'll meet in the country. The Clark City in Whoa. Pampanga also has become an ideal home and a preferred destination for That's foreign investments and tourism mm -hmm. because of its the noise almost they made zero they crime rate. Whoa. And because it houses its own airport, Clark I International Airport, which is less crowded than the Naya Airport in Manila, Clark. and with domestic and international flights that That's are available cool. daily. A little mm. valley. Jolly Bee. Yeah, buddy. And we are definitely doing Jolly Bee again. Number two, yeah. Tagaytay. Tagaytay. 
Dubbed as the second summer capital of the Philippines, the city of Tagaytay is one of the country's most popular destinations because of its beautiful scenery and yeah. clean air. Those who can't too far though from the water. Metro Manila usually choose <laughs> I need to, to be able to put my foot out the front door and touch the water. Drive yeah. away from the city. Another main reason why retirees, tourists and locals prefer to settle in Tagaytay is because of its weather. The place is popular for having cool weather all year round provided by its high altitude. More than its close proximity to Manila, Tagaytay is also filled with breathtaking tourist spots like Tut Al Lake and Sky Ranch, making it one of the best towns to live in. And last but definitely not the Bugio. least is Baguio City. Bugio. For a long time, Baguio City has been a favorite Baguio, place to live Baguio. in, not just by locals, but by many foreign nationals and retirees. Named as the city of pines and summer capital of the Philippines, Baguio City has the perfect cool weather that everybody enjoys. The only like downside the of Baguio of... is its traffic problems, especially during holidays. That's due to the increasing population, the making it also harder to look for a good property in the small city. Nevertheless, you can also opt to get a home in its nearby Benguet provinces like La Trinidad, so you can enjoy Baguio City's charm. The place is loved because of its breathtaking Ooh, tourist spots. Cool. It also houses some of the best schools, restaurants and markets in the country, plus its beautiful people, and community is another main reason to live in Baguio City. With the beautiful people. The beautiful people. The beautiful people. Those are just some of the best places to live in the Philippines. If you are new here, please subscribe and remember. If you guys liked that video, subscribe to the original creator that I will tag down in the description down below. I wonder how many people subscribe to these channels. I don't know. Like after us. Like obviously somebody has subscribed to them that suggested to us. It's right. just how many, you know. If you return. do subscribe to these guys, let us know in the comments. Yeah, I'd like to know. Be like, yeah, I subscribed to them. This was a dope video. <laughs> I agree. Uh, this was a good video. Uh, well put together. I. It was kind of odd that he kept using the same B-roll for the same cities. Yeah, um, it's like... I mean, to be fair, if he's not actually there, from then, there it's then it's far. Yeah. Um, but if he... Well, he can't be from all of these places. Yeah, well, that, obviously. That he be. could have visited these places. Yeah. Uh, guys, let us know again if your city was not on here, but you think that it's more beautiful than any of these cities. First. And let us know Argue in the comments with other people, not us. Yeah. <laughs> also, give us a link to a video. Let, let us check it out. Yeah. So with that being said, my name is Miles. My name is Fez. Thanks for watching, guys. Peace. Out.